Hey guys, uh, Yippee TV today, we're in my garage and uh, we're going to do a quick full beginner's shoulder workout for you guys like, again. We're just starting out. Uh, as you guys know, I still have my full chest workout for beginners out there and uh, you guys really enjoyed that one. So we're going to take you step by step through each shoulder workout and we're going to do three shoulder workouts. Okay, because there are three heads of the shoulder in case you guys are starting out and you didn't know that. We have the front delt, okay, we have the side delt, and okay, what's this one? Rear delt. All right, we got the rear delt. Okay, today we're gonna do three exercises. All right, we're gonna start off with the side raises for um, the side delts, okay? And then we're gonna go to the shoulder pressing, okay? And then we're gonna go through uh, front raises, okay? So you work the shoulder out. For the rear delts, um, I'm not gonna do any isolation exercises for the rear delts just yet. Maybe in the next full beginner shoulder workout, I'll do that. Let's start off with the first exercise, but before we get into that, I want to talk about warming up the shoulder area or any other muscle that you're about to hit, because the main thing you want to do as a beginner is pull the muscle, especially the shoulder, because everybody always has shoulder problems, whether it's uh, shoulder surgery, a shot of whatever in the shoulder, I can't do this, my shoulder hurts from bench pressing or whatever. So we're gonna warm up and you're gonna stretch out your shoulders and do maybe arm circles for about 30 seconds. See right? and keep, keep warming up the area, stretch it out, about 15 seconds, all right? Because we do not want an injury. The last thing you guys need as a beginner is an injury in the shoulder, man. It's the worst one in the world. All right, once you feel warm, you feel good enough, all right? You're gonna start off with a light pair of dumbbells, all right? About, I'd say for the first exercise of side raises, you're gonna grab about the 2.5 pound dumbbells. All right, I know it sounds like too light, but once you do this exercise, understand that it will burn and it will feel good. All right, so these are the 10 pounds, but picture the 2.5, uh, the 2.5 ones, all right? What we're gonna do here, we're gonna do 12 to 15 reps, okay? When doing a side raise, okay, you're gonna come out and keep your arms straight the whole time. I know you guys seen people out there who bend their arms like that, but today we're gonna do a little bit differently. All right, we're gonna keep it nice and slow, okay? so. Let's do it up. First set right here, 12 to 15 reps. One, arm straight the whole time. Come down nice and slow. Let's do about 13 more. 15 to 20 reps and you're feeling good and you're feeling that it's a little bit too light, maybe you want to jump to the five pound dumbbells. Don't jump to the 10, don't jump to the 15. Add another, add another couple pounds, get the shoulder burning. Remember to wait 30 to 35 seconds, rest in between each set. So we just did 15 reps. Now we're gonna wait about 30 to 35 seconds. You're gonna count in your head and then you're gonna either do the same weight or increase it by 2.5, okay? So when 30 to 35 seconds goes by, Pick up the dumbbells again, do another 12 to 15 reps. Feel the shoulder burn, baby. Side delts, man. Remember, arms straight, no bending. Four, five, six. Make sure you're looking at yourself in the mirror. Watching them shoulders grow. Come on. 10, 11, 12. I'm burning up here, man. Should've done shoulders yesterday. One more. Good. Okay, after you finish doing your second set of 12 to 15 reps, you're gonna wait another 30 to 35 seconds and you grab the dumbbells, either go up by 2.5 or do them again if they were too light, but if they feel like it was kind of a struggle, stay with them and just do another set. We're on our last set here for the side raises. All right, but now your shoulders should feel a little warm, feel a little good, feel a little rounded. Okay, about to be at 35 seconds coming up. Let's grab it again, aim for 12 to 15 reps. Let's go. Stop breathing. All right, you know what? Let me show you guys from this way, all right? Remember, straight out, okay? Straight. No bending right now. It's later, there's time and place for everything, all right? Let's go, 15 reps. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. Come on, baby. Burn it up. 14, 15, nice. Okay, so I dealt, probably will be burning up right now, man. I'm doing the 10 pounders right now, and they feel kind of good, you know? 
They feel kind of good. I feel nice and round, man. Should have done shoulders yesterday, though. All right, let's move on to our second exercise right now. It's the front raise, the dumbbell front raise. Um, I did these a lot in the beginning, but I have overpowering front delts, so the bench press alone works out my front delts to another level. So doing front raises for me is not as essential as it would be for, for a beginner because you don't want a, a muscle lagging behind. So after you finish your three sets of side raises, you're gonna go to the front raises, okay? And you can either stick with the same weight that you start off with, the 2.5 pounds on melt, or you can go to the five or the 10. You can probably do a little bit more because this exercise is a little different, but if you want to stick with it, be smart, let's do it up then, all right? So you go to the dumbbell rack, maybe grab a little bit more, a little bit, uh, a little bit less, and we'll do the front raise, baby. Get these front delts looking big from the front. Okay, now the front raise, what do we do? How do we do it? All right, there's different variations of ways to do it. All right, uh, you can either go all the way up above your head or you can come to about your eye level. I always went to about my eye level, even though people like Arnold all of, went all the way up, but I feel like that's more momentum rather than using the muscle. So what we're gonna do is put the dumbbells by your side, all right? Bring it up, keep your arms straight. Bring it to your eye, it covers your eyesight. See come down, thing. same thing with the left arm, okay? One rep for each arm, so we're gonna do about 15 reps here, okay? Let's go. Three sets, 15 reps, 35 to 40 seconds rest in between each set. You ready, Eddie? Because we are full of worms, lad. Believe it or not, each and every one of us in this room is one day going to stop. Arm straight. Down, count to 35 to 40 seconds rest in your head and do another set of about 12 to 15 reps now if you guys saw my previous full chest workout video you saw that I stuck with three sets of eight but I think the shoulders work a little bit differently and they need a little bit more um, reps and they burn a lot better with more reps so we stick between 12 to 15 reps for the shoulders as of right now for a beginner so 35 seconds goes by you're sweating you're pumped you either grab the same pair or you increase the weight by five, up to you. For me, I'm gonna stick with the same pair and we're gonna do another set. You ready? Okay, arm straight, bring the dumbbell up. All right, here we go, one. Seize the day. seconds rest in between each set okay you don't want to wait too long you guys out there are waiting like two to three four five minutes in between each set that's not good man you let all the muscle fibers recruit and blah 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 it's just a whole bunch of nonsense 35 to 40 seconds rest as a beginner that's long enough we're on our last set for the front races grab those dumbbells either same weight or increase it and let's do our last set of front raises man Come on now. Come on, baby. Three. Three. Matt, so you guys are not going up too high. Not too high. Not too high. Right above the eye. Six. Six. Seven. Seven. All right, and we're good for the front raises right there, man. Now we're gonna move on to our last exercise, and that is either the barbell the press day. or the dumbbell oh, press. Oh, now, man. for me as a beginner, I always chose the, the dumbbells first. All right, 
And most of you guys probably won't have an access to a bar like this. And um, so if you get a pair of dumbbells, this will work just as fine. Uh, barbell later. Remember, there's time for that, but you know, you're just starting out. You want to get the shoulders used to what's going on. Okay, now for by now, your shoulders probably are a little bit exhausted. Okay, and that's okay. Uh, you could probably go a little bit heavier now. Now, if you were doing the 2.5s in the beginning, maybe jump to about the 15 pound dumbbells in each hand, maybe the 20. That's it. I say 15 first. So, we're gonna grab the 15 pound dumbbells, all right, and we're gonna do the standing dumbbell shoulder press. Okay, why? Because you know, as a beginner, we're working on core a little bit. Right? You want the core to uh, lag behind in the future. So if you're working on it from the beginning, um, that's a smart move because then you'll find out later that things are going to fall behind. So from the beginning, I would say target the, um, the secondary things and the ones that are not important because eventually they become important and they become annoying. Then you got to put them first, then you got to train them. So from the start, have discipline and do the right thing. All right, so when you're standing with the 20 pound, 15 pound dumbbells for you guys, Okay, now how to do the actual standing dumbbell press is quite simple. So you guys grab the 15 pound dumbbells, you do three sets, same thing, 12 to 15 reps for shoulders here. All right, and you're gonna, um, you're gonna slowly bring them up, okay? And you keep them right there. All right, and you're gonna slightly bend your knees a little bit so you keep the spine intact, all right? And you're gonna come up and you're gonna bring the, sh uh, the dumbbells over your head, come up and bring them back down where you started with, okay? You don't wanna bring them up forward like this. You wanna bring them up over your head, you know, nice and straight, okay? Just like that, all right? 12 to 15 reps, first set, let's go. Okay, knees slightly bent, looking forward, everything's intact, bring the shoulders up, let's do it, man. down, place them down, all right, if they were too light, increase the weight by five pounds, wait 35 to 40 seconds, if they were too heavy, you can either stick with them or drop it a little bit, but they'd probably be okay, so if you can get about eight to 12 reps with it right now, that's good, because your shoulders are probably a little exhausted, so we just did our first set, okay, we got two more sets, 30 to 35 seconds goes by, pick up the dumbbells again, all right, we'll do our second set, all right, same thing, Let's go, 30, 35 seconds passes, nothing longer. Nothing shorter, baby. Bring them up, same thing. Okay, and proceed. 15 reps, three, four, five, six. Good form here. Okay, put them down, same thing, wait 30 to 45 sec 30 to 40 seconds. Okay, count in your head, nothing longer, man. How are we on our last set here? Um, remember, building muscle takes a while. It's a long time. You just gotta be disciplined, you gotta stick it out. It's gradual, it's rewarding, so you gotta dig deep, you gotta believe in yourself, and good things will come your way. It's a beautiful sport. Beautiful heart. I love it so much. All right, 30, 35 seconds goes by. Pick up the same weight or increase it. Let's go for 12 to 15 reps again. Blasting those shoulders. I promise you, you'll feel tomorrow. Okay, bring them up. Same thing right here. All right, 12 to 15 reps, Ed. Go. Come on. Two, three, four, five. Good form. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. Okay. Put those weights down. You're good for shoulders. Now, I noticed we didn't do the rear delts today, honestly. We didn't target them specifically. But maybe next time for our next shoulder workout, we'll do something with those. But just starting out, as of right now, uh, we're going to focus a little bit more on the fundamentals and breaking down each exercise individually. So, remember to always believe uh, gaining muscle is not easy. It takes a while, but if you stick with it and you follow these 
um, workouts, routines, and everything. This is what I used when I was younger when I first started out. So I know they work. Uh, you just got to be very, very patient and believe. And it's simple as that. So, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, never give up.